Are you single now, Brandon? Word is you are not. Yes. Yeah, so, um, <laughs> so, you know, and Sassy Key, you sort of have a thing of getting back with your exes. Um, and, like, <laughs> once you see this Feel season, that. yeah, yeah, once you see this season, you'll see exactly sort of how, like, circle I did and, like, my route of, like, <laughs> The girls. circle of siesta. The circle of siesta, <laughs> yeah. And I, I sort of, like, I went around. Um, but, you know, I guess, like, uh, I sort of, like, I'm not, I'm not single, I'm not super take. I'm not taken, I'm sort of like right here, but um. What would the girl you're seeing say about that? <laughs> no, no, well, her, her, her name's Camilla, and it's one of those things where, you know, like, we sort of just, like, I like her, she's really cool, you know, like, I, I enjoy her company. Um, oh my god, but that's like the worst thing for any girl to hear. No, no. She's mm, cool, I like, no. she, I like to spend time with no, her. No, I do, I do, it's just So like, is my mom. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just like sometimes it's relationships in Siesta Key just like yeah, they're they're hard. Mm. <laughs> they're hard, you know. So it's like it's not like all the guys. I just sort of like you know I I I, I enjoy where I'm at right now, and that's that's it. <laughs> okay, season um, three, you're both vets. Um, yeah. How has this season stepped it up a notch? I, I just, I feel like out of every season, like this season, season three, mm -hmm. everybody sort of was just like all on the yeah, other. Everyone just like know? threw their hands up and was like, screw yeah. it. And just like lets everything out, I feel yeah. like this season. Exactly. On top of that, there's just like new members this season and like even they're like super involved with everything. Yeah. And, uh, just like super real life stuff going on this yeah. season. A lot of relationship stuff, a lot of like, yeah. I'm single, you're single. Yeah, and that's a... That's a combination yeah. right there. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's never good with us. <laughs> um, so you guys have a new cast member, Robbie. Robbie um, Monday. how does he shake things up? Uh, well, he, he, you actually have a lot to do with that. <laughs> she sort of brought him. Yeah, I actually in. brought him into the group, I'd say, and I introduced Juliet and him to each other at Stagecoach, and they hit it off immediately, and we're. 100% like immediately in love and just mm -hmm. crazy little lovebirds and then they come back to Siesta Key and everyone has their opinions and judgment and a lot of a lot of our friends in the group aren't fans of Robbie to say the yeah, least. Yeah. To say it in the nicest manner. And that's like without even really knowing him too, you know. It's just yeah. sort of like because the fact that he like is with Juliet. Like he took Juliet and Juliet out of everyone's like the I guess like the most like like popular slash like <laughs> slash she's like, the cool girl yeah 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 I, I mean i don't even know how to put it but he came back with her and then it was just like oh no not jewels everyone didn't like him for like i guess that reason uh, you think that's why i think because he was on the bachelor and like everything that everyone has heard on social media mm -hmm. and on tv and this is his fourth up. reality show yeah so everyone's just like oh he's there for the clout yeah. like, that's, that's basically true. what a lot of people in the group are saying. That's true. Yeah. Um, what do you guys think of him and Juliet um, ending things? They're done, they said, but I said I think I still see a spark there. <laughs> I think he still has feelings for her. Yeah, yeah he, probably, he probably still has like a little like feelings still in there, yeah. and it's just like, they, they're really cool around each other still, so you yeah. know, whenever like, I guess like, ex, like you break up with somebody mm -hmm. and you're still cool around each other, mm -hmm. there's always like room for like, it's, all, it's always like there. Yeah, yeah you know. Kelsey, you and Kara have not always gotten along. No. Where do you, what do we see happen with your relationship this season? Um, well, I'd say since last season, there was a lot of things said on her part that I didn't know about. And then when I watched the show, I was like, oh, you said that about me and my family. And so I got really mad about that. So right off the bat, I hadn't seen her in a long time. And in the first episode, I see her and she immediately is already telling Garrett that he can't even like, hang out around me and him and I weren't at the time like we both were hadn't seen each other in a while and so it's the first time we're seeing each other and it's at Jules's graduation like celebration so I didn't really think it was a big deal I was like how are you how's your family and he's being all weird with me and when he told me that like she want, doesn't want him around me I'm like are you kidding me like you're just letting this girl control you and I feel like that's something that she's done a lot of times in the past mm -hmm. And then in front of my, like, I heard, overheard her talking about me mm. behind my back. And I'm like, okay, I've had it. And so you see me blow up yeah. in the first episode, for mm. sure. Well, 
on the edge, you know? Yeah, I, I did that, but whatever. That's okay. Um, you maybe had a right, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's, she's not a nice girl. Yeah. Tell me about um, you and Garrett. Would we ever mm -hmm. see that come back together? Are you mm -hmm. single now? Well, it's like what Brandon's saying, how when you were in a relationship with someone, it's always something's there. And so I think that's definitely something that you will see throughout the season. Yeah, okay. you guys are so like, cool with each other, so I could... Yeah, so... You never know. You never know. <laughs> okay. Um, you are not the only one that gets a little heated in the first uh, mm -hmm. episode. We can't say too much of why, <laughs> but yeah. what Dude. is it like losing your cool like that? Looking back, do you like laugh at yourself, or um, is it like? Um, it's I I guess it's sort of just like because I'm always like super cool. Like I'm always like I never really let it get there. I loved it. Um, yeah, <laughs> she loved it. But you know, it's it's sort of just like one of those things like. That was that was like my moment. Like I just sort of like I didn't have time to process it, and it's just like in your face, like mm. right here. And before I even got to like take it in, I was already blowing up, you mm. know. And I guess looking back, like I laugh a little bit, but it's just like man, like uh, kind of scary, you know. <laughs> like, yeah, <laughs> kind of exploded. It's a lot of people don't think that it's real emotions that you guys are. Expressing, mm -hmm. um, you know, they think it's scripted, but you can't fake that. No, there's I mean, no way. That's raw emotion, you yeah. know, and it's like that's mm -hmm. it.